I knew it before the season started. When the Warriors traded away Jordan Poole for Chris Paul, I already knew it was a horrible trade. Yeah, we're only one fourth of the NBA season in, but with the Warriors three games under 500 and currently 11th in the West, their whole team just looks like a whole mess right now. I thought the Warriors were done, but I did not think that they would be this bad. I gotta give it to Steph Curry though, he looks amazing, but now he knows how LeBron felt in 2018 because he has no hope. Like Wiggins has not played that good this year and Clay is shooting less than 40% from three, which he has never done in his career. Some could say Clay is getting washed, but the main problem is Draymond Green. I don't think anyone has ever thought Draymond Green would get suspended two times in one year because of his past history of suspensions. But just a few days ago, Draymond Green did a full 360 and slapped Yusuf Nurkic to the face, which knocked him to the floor. After the game, Draymond said it was an accident, but if you rewatch the replay, it clearly looks on purpose. With Draymond choking Rudy Gobert with the headlock this year, I think we gotta officially have Draymond Green in the WWE and not the NBA with the moves he's pulling off. The NBA has suspended Draymond Green indefinitely, which I think is good and hopefully will finally stop him from pulling off these WWE type moves. I think the Warriors dynasty, dynasty is starting to end and don't be surprised if Draymond Green or Clay are not in a Warriors uniform next season. Let me know, are the Warriors officially done or can they regroup and make a finals run this year?